Hey guys, Mac Guzman here, and back with another video on my BSA channel, and today is going to be about my status of Eagle Scout in only two years. So, a quick overview, there's 7 Scout ranks, 16 leadership positions, and 21 merit badges. At the moment, I have 3 out of the 7 ranks. I got Scout rank, I have Tenderfoot rank, and I have the 2nd class rank. So that's 3 out of the 7 in total for scout for scouting. And for leadership positions, there's like 16 of them. And so far, I've had quartermaster, I'm patrol leader at the moment, and I'm also a den chief. So that's 3 out of the 16. For badges, I, I have 3 of them as well. I got the swimming merit badge, the first aid merit badge, and the citizenship in the world merit badge. So that's 3 out of the 21 that I need for eagle. There's a lot of merit badges, but you only need 21 for Eagle Scout. So the first thing you get is Arrow of Light if you were in Cub Scouts. It's the only badge earned from Cub Scouts that's worn on a Boy Scout uniform. It cannot be earned as a Boy Scout, but it crosses over. So I got that completed when I joined, obviously, when I joined Boy Scouts. And then the Scout Rank, it covers basic information of good scouting. The oath, the law, the motto, the slogan, the spirit, scouting, patrols, knots, and safety. So I got that a little after I joined Boy Scouts, so I completed that. And then I had a really long gap until I got Tenderfoot. It was like a three-year gap. So it, Tenderfoot covers basic information about camping, cooking, tools, first aid, and nature, hiking, fitness, citizenship, leadership, and scout spirit. So I got that completed last year, and it was like a three-year gap, but I got that completed. And then that brings us into second class, which I completed that last month. And it covers more information about camping, cooking and tools, navigation, nature, aquatics, first aid, fitness, citizenship, personal safety, and scout spirit. So I finally completed that just recently last month, so I'm pretty proud. And I was working on second class and first class simultaneously, so I'm almost complete with first class. And this, these are like the more advanced and final things you should know about cooking, camping, tools, etc. So I'm 68% of the way there. I just got a few more things to do. And once I get that, then I'll be done with first class and it's on to the more advanced ones like Star Scout. Star Scout requires four months as a first class. So if I get first class by the end of February, that means I'll get Star Scout by the beginning of summer. So I need four months as first class, six merit badges, uh, four required for Eagle, six hours of service as a first class, and four months in a leadership role. So I'm 29% of the way there because I already have three merit badges, and so that's in progress as well. The next rank is Life Scout. You need to be six months as a Star Scout. You need to have five more merit badges, and three of them have to be Eagle required. You need to have six hours of service as a Star Scout and six months leadership role. So I'm 11% of the way there because I only have a little bit done and that's in progress as well. And finally, there's the Eagle Scout. You need to have six months as a Life Scout, 21 merit badges, and, thir uh, and you need to have all 13 required for Eagle. You need to have six months as a leadership position and then the Eagle Scout service project, which is probably the hardest. So I'm 11% of the way there, and I'm in progress of that too. So the swimming merit badge, I got that done last month in January, and I did that in winter camp, so I got that completed there. Also at winter camp, I got the first aid merit badge, so I did those two at the same time, so I got that done at winter camp too. And then shortly after I came back home from winter camp, I did the citizenship in the world merit badge by myself, and I got that done as well. So I, knock, I knocked out three merit badges in one month. And then and now, now I'm working on the personal management <clears throat> merit badge. And I'm 73% of the way there. I have everything else done except for the waiting. There's like a 13 week wait process you need to do while tracking your spending. And I'm only like eight weeks in. So I got a little bit left to do. But after that, I have the merit badge. I'm also working on the cycling merit badge. It says 64%. But I really only have one requirement left, so that's some progress. It's the last 22 miler you need to do. 
I've done all the others except the 22 miler, so once I get that, then I'll have the cycling merit badge. I'm working on the camping merit badge as well, and I'm actually 56% of the way there because I figured out that most of the stuff for the camping merit badge is actually in the first four, uh, first four scout ranks. So in scout, tenderfoot, second class, and first class, it covers almost half of the stuff you need in camping, so that's pretty good. So I only need to do a little bit more left to get the camping merit badge. Alright guys, thank you for watching my eagle status on getting an eagle scout in less than two years. I hope you enjoyed. Please like the video, turn on notifications, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!